Welcome, folks. Welcome. Yes, this is the Boston game here. In this little playthrough, as you might be able to tell, is Fallout 4. Yes, and... Um, we're going to... This is kind of like... Kind of like... So we're gonna do a new game here, folks. New game here. So, yes. We are gonna play a new game over here. I love Fallout, by the way. Fallout's one of my favorites, along with Doom. Um, so, let's get into it, shall we? I haven't uploaded in a while, cause uh, I've just been doing other shit, been kind of busy. But, uh, I figured we could tackle this game. Um, we have a lot of games to tackle now, so I think, uh, what are we tackling? Like, three games now? Four games now, including this one we're tackling. So that should be, pl that should give plenty of time for us to, uh, fucking play games over here. And fucking just do a lot of shit, you know. So... Yeah, let's have fun, shall we? War never changes, uh, war. War. War never changes. War never changes. Where Ron Perlman at? In the year 1945, my great-great-grandfather served in the let Army. This play wondered when he'd get to go home to his wife and the son he'd never seen. He got his wish when the U.S. ended World War II by dropping atomic bombs on Hiroshima and Nagasaki. The world awaited Armageddon. And instead, something miraculous happened. We began to use atomic energy not as a weapon. We're just going to let this uh, play out. A source of power. That's why I'm quiet. People enjoyed luxuries once thought the realm of science fiction. Domestic robots. Fusion-powered cars. Portable computers. But then, in the 21st century, people awoke from the American dream. Years of consumption led to shortages of every major resource. The entire world unraveled. Peace became a distant memory. I like the idea of a retro future. It is now the year 2077. We stand on the brink of total war. And I am afraid for myself, for my wife, for my infant son. See, I like this intro a lot better than uh, Fallout 3 in New Vegas. If they could have done this style of intro for both of those games, I think War never changes. it would have been pretty cool. Like, live action-y kind of shit. You know, like... Like a movie playing played out. I think that would have been better. Um, instead of just still pictures. But, you know, that they made it for what it was. And it was what it was, right? So, I really Ooh, can't complain that much. You're gonna knock him dead at the Veterans Hall tonight, hon. You think? So, time Absolutely. to build the character, folks. Now get ready and stop hogging the mirror. Right. Time to build, uh... We will go with face first. Markings. Moles. Yeah, that's a lot of mole. They got the De Niro mole. Haha. <laughs> uh, let's go back. Blemishes. Uh, 
Uh, we're gonna roughen this guy up. Oh, yeah, we'll do that. Looking good. Wait, where the fuck did it go? Not bad. Not bad. Damage. You have such a strong chin. Oops. Press the wrong button, folks. Or remove that, remove that. Force smile. Oh, what's that? Oh, I like that. What do you think, hon? Roguishly handsome or handsomely roguish? Wait a minute. What the fuck? Where did it all go here? All right, where? Right stitch. Oh, I didn't put apply. That's why. Duh, I was I was pressing accept, not uh, not apply. We're gonna do. Or smile. A nose act. One of these. We're gonna really make this guy look like he's he's fucked a few. Mean motherfuckers. Ooh, wait, I like that one too. Uh, I think that's enough, right? We don't want to go overboard here. All right. So handsome. Uh, back. We'll go with where's hair? Is there a hair option? Is it face? There we go, style. So we'll do. I like a mohawk. Where is the hawk? Uh. Pompadour. Uh, where is it? Oh, we can go as John Romero. Ha <laughs> ha! My little nod to John Romero. They ain't got no fucking, like... Did I miss it? I might have missed it. I don't know. Ombre. Yeah, we'll do this. Fuck it. I don't. I don't. I don't see a mohawk anywhere. So this new haircut's really working for me. We'll make it. Um. There a There's no blue, huh? One thing I don't like about this game as opposed to say the other two is that I mean, I don't see anywhere where you can actually you know, create a color. You know, your own color. Uh, 
like a blue or something. It's all pre. You got just these options. Hey, did you get a but yesterday? whatever. It's cute. I guess you can't really. Can't do much. All right, we want to. We want to. We want to be a thin motherfucker. Not too thin. We actually. There we go. We want to make this motherfucker look really like battle axed. All right, I think we're done, folks. I think we're fucking done. What's extras? This markings, that's all that markings means, huh? Huh. I guess, uh, I thought for sure you could do tattoos. I guess I can, huh? Oh, well. All right, I think we're done, folks, so let's, uh, Yes, we'll customize it. I mean, confirm it, not customize it. All right. So we are officially off and running. Hello there. Huh? I'll just be a minute. Yeah, sure you will, asshole. All right. So, yeah, this is the point where we just look around. That's all we're doing is looking around. Abraxo for all your cleaning needs. Abraxo. Wait. Another fine product of General Atomics International. See, the thing is, I'm so glad they brought back the old music from, uh... No need to get dressed twice. Um, from the older games, the, uh, three. It just brings, it just brings you back to, it, 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 it just makes you feel like you're playing Fallout instead of a, you know, another game. But, um... You know, I'm just I'm just glad they brought that back. It just it just, it just brings you back, you know? It just brings you back. And I just absolutely love that cigarettes. Cigarettes. Now who left those here? Grognak the barbarian in the jungle of the bat babies. Yeah. My favorite. Codsworth. Yeah, fuck. All right, let's talk to Cosworth. Cosworth. Enjoy your coffee, sir. I'll be sleeping on All right, the floor. fuck you then. Hun. We should take Cosworth to be service soon, don't you think? I shall attend to young Shaw. Hmm. You know. Yeah, folks, there's not much to do in this. Uh, Good old USA. To do in this so proud of part of the game right here, you're just kind of looking around and. Getting familiar with the characters and what not and what forth. Hey, hon. Can't believe it's almost Halloween. Kids finished making Sean's costume. But, yeah. Hey, Codsworth. Don't worry about the dishes. All right. Insta mash, fancy lad snack cakes, Blamco mac and cheese. Expires in never. All right. Huh? Can you get the door? Whenever I answer, he just asks for you over and over. Come on. Ah, oh, yeah. Here we go. Good morning. 
Voltec calling. Voltec. Good morning. Isn't it? Just look <laughs> at that sky out there. <clears throat> you can't begin to know how happy I am to finally speak with you. I've been trying for days. It's a matter of utmost urgency, I assure you. What's so important? Why, nothing less than your entire future. If you haven't noticed, sir, this country has gone to heck in a handbasket. If you'll excuse my language, the big kaboom is... It's inevitable, I'm afraid, and coming sooner than you may think. If you catch my meaning... Now, I know you're a busy fellow, so I won't take up much of your time. Fucking time being damn a, right you won't. A precious commodity. I'm here today to tell you that because of your family service to our country... I should have turned on subtitles, damn it. Pre-selected for entrance... Sorry about that, folks. Local vault. Vault 111. Sounds great. Oh, it is. Believe you me. Now, you're already cleared for entrance. In Believe the you me. Event of Fucking asshole. Uh, Fucking salesperson asshole. Annihilation. <laughs> <laughs> I just need to verify some information. That's all. Oh, okay. Tell me more about this vault. Oh, it has all the amenities of the modern home, I assure you. Not to mention total protection from nuclear radiation and hostile mutants. A better future underground. It's not only our mission, it's our <laughs> passion. All right, asshole. Yes. Sure, let's do it. Splendid. Splendid. Now, uh, <clears throat> let's see. All right, so this is where we pick our... Uh, Strengths, perception, and shit. Uh, strength is going to be important. Um, so is endurance. Definitely put that up. Charisma is also very, very important. Um, so we're going to put that up, the speech. Intel, we'll put the 5. Agility, 3. Luck. Actually, we'll put that up to 5. And put this up to 6. Perception, I really don't give a fuck about, folks. Perception, I don't know, if you're, if you're, if you're all into vats and shit, but of course, all these things you can you can up up during gameplay too. Once you get certain, you know, once you play for a bit and get the shit. Uh, so, and we're gonna name we're gonna name my guy asshole. We're going to name him Asshole Frank. How's that? Asshole Frank. There we go. Perfect. Asshole Frank. <laughs> That's my shit right there, motherfucker. Alright. Alright, I think we're good. I think we're good, folks. Wonderful. That's everything. Uh, just going to walk this over to the vault. Congratulations on being prepared for the future. Um, thanks again. Hey, it's peace of mind. <laughs> Asshole, Frank. It's like a little paperwork, right? For you and Sean, no price is too high. <laughs> Good answer. I wonder if that's Ron Perlman. Voice. Sir, Sean has been changed, but he absolutely refuses to calm down. Well, get the fuck out of my way then, and I'll fucking. You seem to be so good at. You heard Codsworth. Go on. Idiot. All right. How are the 
two most important men in my life doing? Spin the mobile a bit. He loves that. Spin. Much better now, huh? <laughs> Listen, after breakfast, right. I was thinking we could head to the park for a bit. Weather should hold up. Yeah, sounds like fun. Sir, Mom, <laughs> you should come and see this. Codsworth, what's wrong? All right, let's go. Followed by yes. Followed by flashes, blinding flashes, sounds of explosions. Yes. Uh, trying to get confirmation. What? We seem to have lost contact. With and this is. We do, we do have, we do have coming in. That's um. Confirmed reports. I repeat, confirmed reports of nuclear detonations in New York and Pennsylvania. Huh. My God. Please stand by. We, we need to get to the vault now. So, folks, let me tell you this right now. Don't go try and wandering off what path you're supposed to be on, cause you will die. Um, you're kind of on a time limit here, folks. Um, you, you have to get to the vault. And, you know, don't don't waste your time. I mean, it's fun to see what happens if you waste time, but. Um, if you don't get to the vault, you will die. The the thing will explode and you'll die. So we need to get in. We're on the list. Infant, adult male, adult female. Okay, go ahead. So you wanna you kind of wanna go as quickly as you can to the vault. We're doing everything we can. Now keep moving. Alright. Almost there. We're gonna be okay. I love you. Both of you. We love you too. Oh my god! And there it is. Hold on! Well then. I don't know if you would survive that being that close to an atomic bomb. Even I don't I don't think you'd really survive that, but you know, it's it's a it's a video game, folks. It's a video game. So, all right. We're here. We did it. We made it. We're okay. Everyone, please step off the elevator and proceed up the stairs in an orderly fashion. No need to worry. Fuck out of my way. We'll get everyone situated in your new home, Vault 111. A better future underground. I'm going first, motherfucker. Just step over to the table. Take a seat. Just step over to the table. This way. Uh. Hi. Thanks. What now? Just follow the doctor here. He'll show you where to go. All right, you three. Follow me. Yeah, you it's fucking assholes. Right Hurry up, there. motherfucker. This is our new home. Oh, you're gonna love it here. This is one of our most advanced facilities. Not that the others aren't great, mind you. Gone. Our home. Everything we had. Sir? My mother and father down in D.C. Scooby-Doo, Scooby-Doo, we're wandering oh, off from me and you. Scooby-Doo, fucking Scooby, fucking do. We are moving around, and so are you. These people, I feel bad for you. Assholes, you don't even see what's coming. All right. Hey there. Just this way. Just step in here and put your vault suit on. All right. The pod will decontaminate and depressurize you before we head deeper in the vault. Just relax. <sighs> Time for a whole new life. Resident <laughs> secure. <sighs> Occupant 
occupant vitals. Normal. Procedure complete. Yeah, right. Stupid idiots. In Gotta love coffee, folks. Gotta love coffee. Oh, man. All right. So. Anyway. That was the first kind of half. The kind of section of Fallout 4. And now, we wake up to these fucking assholes. Alright. And then after this, folks, we will get out of here. And we will continue this game probably tomorrow. These fucking assholes. Oh, I can't wait to meet you, you son of a bitch. I can't wait to meet you. See, folks, it's good to kind of put yourself in the character's position. That way you can feel what the character would would be feeling and you know it, it helps it helps when you're playing video games it does help get into, into the character that you are playing and seeing that if I would have saw that oh I couldn't wait to see this asshole I couldn't wait I couldn't oh I can't wait to see you buddy I got guns for days for you buddy yeah so it's good to kind of like get into the what get into the mind of what the character would be like be like in certain situations you know what I mean so that being said yeah I kind of like to talk like that when I'm playing a game like oh I can't wait to, to kill you I can't wait to you know fuck you fuck this you know all right folks so we'll wait until I can actually play She did. Alright, so, um, I'm gonna call it here, folks. Uh, we'll save. Asshole Frank. Asshole Frank. Alright, we'll save over this. All right, folks, and that is it for me. I hope you all enjoyed this little playthrough that we're doing here on Fallout 4. Um, this is going to be exciting. So, um, yeah, uh, if you like what you see, don't forget to hit subscribe. Um, I really do appreciate it. Um, and drop a like on it if you like it. So, take care, everyone, and have a great day.